Hans Zimmer has created many memorable scores for films like The Dark Knight Trilogy, Man of Steel, and Interstellar. The composer just revealed that the idea for Justice League will be to write themes for each individual member, which would then be used for their eventual standalone films. Christian Byers sell a separate theme for every Justice League member. Huge buy. Out of all the stories I've ever bought in this, this is one of the biggest ones. Because <laughs> one of my biggest problems with Marvel is that they just keep changing up their composers after every movie because it's it's cheaper and maybe they don't think that people are paying attention to it. Like if you look at Iron Man, they got rid of the ACDC stuff, and in Captain America, you hear it score his theme for like a brief second. Mm. You so like when you think of like Superman and even Danny Elfman's Batman, like you think of these themes that really identify the characters. To to hear that each one of them is going to have a separate one. It's brilliant. It's really smart, and you're gonna you're gonna be able to the second you hear it in whatever future film, you're gonna that's the Aquaman theme, that's the Flash theme, and I think it's brilliant. And to have Hans Zimmer being the guy that is the John Williams of it all is is really smart and good for DC. That's a point, a big point for DC for doing that. Chuck, um, I'm gonna bring up the Amazing Spider-Man Two uh, <laughs> musical composer Hans Zimmer. I thought it was horrible. <laughs> You didn't I don't know if you remember that. Drum and bass. I am a macho, I am a like this garbage, horrible I liked that theme. song, so I yeah. know. That was in the film. I'm just, <laughs> just I'm taking it right out of my brain. Um, luckily, we're also talking about Hans Zimmer from The Dark Knight and Man of Steel and countless other, I mean, interstellar. Just, so his, his, uh, his musical composery, I don't know if that's a real word, but I'm just Should be. Use it. I love um, it. It's pretty legendary at this point. I love his theme, especially for The Dark Knight. I have to listen to that while I'm doing my own work or drawing or on Photoshop. Ding, 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 You know, weird, sprinkly nails and stuff. He was doing some really crazy stuff. So I love Man of Steel. I love that theme. So I'm, I'm happy to hear that he's going to keep that one, and then now he only has to do Batman right. for this Batman. So he's got, I got two down. I'll take the other five. I'm sure he was like, no, I'll do that. I already got two of them in the bag, you know? Yeah, just use them. So... I think he's incredibly talented. So, you know, I'm kind of half joking with Spider-Man. I was like, you know, everyone gets a couple stinkers in their career. So whatever. It's like, I think it's a great idea. And to have themes, you know, start. I, I'm sure when we see Jace Momo, we'll hear that Aquaman yeah. theme. And then that's going to be like in a couple of years. Yeah, what's it going to be like? like <laughs> Aquaman. I'm Aquaman. That's a Hawaiian theme song, you know. It's on a surfboard. Just like the musical. Yeah, this would be very Beach Boys. Yeah, you know? I would <laughs> love it if it was Beach Boys. Here comes Aquaman. Look at his pet fish. But it's all dark. <laughs> Tridents and stuff. But they're like, yeah, Aquaman's got a weapon. You know? They're air guitaring on the yeah. Tridents. Fantastic. I mean, I, I buy this too simply because when you initially see the store, it's like, oh, each one's going to have their own theme. That's going to get real crowded and it's going to feel like a, like a sitcom. Like every time somebody comes through a door, it's like, here's my theme. Yeah. Here's my <laughs> theme. But in the way that these movies, at least this movie, is hopefully going to come off, I think it's brilliant, like what Christian said. It's like, I never like, I don't like professional wrestling. I prefer real sports. But with wrestling, when you come, you hear somebody's theme music, and so it's like, fun. oh my God, that's the Flash's theme music. That's going to be really neat to see. And it doesn't have to hit you over the head with it. It can be something a little more subtle, mm. which is the route I hope they take with it. But superheroes, one of the coolest things about them is that they have their own theme. So when you're running on the treadmill at the gym, you get to pretend you're Superman for however long you can maintain that pace. And I think that's an important thing in the DC films going forward. So yes, let's totally do this. I buy it. I love this so much. And you think about the old classic theme songs, and they were just so easy to identify. You know exactly who it was, and you're right, we haven't had that. It's been a shift. I think Hans Zimmer is brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Yes, everyone has a dud, whatever, but we don't know what they asked him to do. Um, but for this, it's perfect, and also as a launch pad to these standalone films, because they're all going to bring their own essence and atmosphere to it. So if you have that distinguishing music, it's just going to be awesome. I'm so excited to see how they create that and how fun for a composer to get to be able to do that in this generation of superhero films. So I think it's brilliant. I wonder if they're going to try like spreading out all the sounds, in all seven of them, and when they come together for Just League, they'll overlay to make it, all seven. Yes. It, it, it you got the, string, the strings, you're on guitars. This guy's yes. just drums. That'd be kind of wild. It's a lot of writing though, man. That's yeah. like six or seven superheroes. Every album has a couple duds in it, so I, I hope they're all cool. Who's going to be the dud? Flash. <laughs> 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 I'm running really fast. I'm running. <laughs> 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 The coolest yeah. one is just really fast guitar tapping. Yeah. Yeah. 
<laughs> Van <laughs> Halen style. Get Eddie Van Halen on that. I wouldn't say no to that. Listen to that, Hans. Hey, everyone. If you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.